a mystic union, the dream of St. Catherine of Alexandria. In the late 16th century, Lodovico Caraxi, a prominent figure in the initiation of the Baroque era, painted an evocative masterpiece titled The Dream of St. Catherine of Alexandria. This painting is a harmonious blend of divine intervention and human emotion, capturing a moment where the celestial and earthly realms intertwine. St. Catherine, adorned in an olive green dress that cascades elegantly around her, is depicted in a state of serene slumber. Her peaceful repose on a stone table enveloped in golden yellow cloth symbolizes purity and sanctity. The intricate details, from her delicately arched eyebrows to the gold ring gracing her finger, are testament to Carax's mastery. Beside her, Mary and the infant Christ emanate divine grace. Mary's gaze, tender yet profound, reflects an ethereal beauty enhanced by the soft halo illuminating her visage. The infant Christ reaches outwards, his dark eyes filled with ancient wisdom yet encapsulated in youthful innocence. Two angels observe this sacred union with protective tenderness, their presence signifies heavenly endorsement. Amidst them lurks faces embedded within brick-red clouds, silent witnesses to this mystic marriage unfolding beneath them. Carax's innovation lies not just within his artistic technique but also his narrative approach. By casting this event as a dream rather than an awake encounter between Saint Catherine and Christ, he infuses an otherworldly quality into this spiritual union. The spiked wheel at the painting's lower left corner reveals Saint Catherine's identity and alludes to her attempted martyrdom. Yet here she is not a martyr but a bride, united with Christ through mystic marriage amidst languorous warmth that pervades every brushstroke. This masterpiece stands as one of Carax's most iconic works, where robust figures bask amidst indeterminate settings, where spirit becomes matter, where viewers are invited not just to observe but to partake in an experience that transcends time, echoing the intense pious emotions sought after during this epoch of religious renaissance.